objective of being happy. Our lives are all different but yet the same. We love to be entertained by different ways in our lives and amongst that is the rendezvous session with our weekly dose of entertainment on your lifestyle show. Yalla Dubai. The dosage of the week will definitely begin with some Bollywood prescription as we take you to meet the star cast of the recently Bollywood released film Love Shuda. लव शुदा बॉलीवुड की रोमांटिक फिल्म है जो कि डायरेक्ट की है वैभव मिश्रा ने और इस फिल्म के लीड एक्टर्स गिरीश कुमार नवनीत कौर ढिल्लो एंड नवनीत कस्तूरिया आई दुबई टू प्रमोट देयर फिल्म इन यूए मार्केट एंड याला दुबई हैड एन इंटरेस्टिंग कॉन्वर्सेशन विद द टीम पोस्ट द प्रेस कॉन्फ्रेंस ऑफ द मूवी ये इवेंट ऑर्गेनाइज हुआ था बाय बॉक्स ऑफिस इवेंट्स हियर इन दुबई character his name is gaurav uh, he's from du uh, from delhi and he goes to london to study and now he's about to get settled he's about to get married or you can say he's about to hang himself <laughs> and uh, so to attend his bachelor party his friends come over and uh, get him really drunk and really hammered and have a lot of fun and in the morning when he wakes up he doesn't remember where he is and he sees this very beautiful girl who wakes up next to him and he, she doesn't know who she is and uh, what happened last night and to find all this out he goes out for a journey and how that journey then changes his life and it becomes a big roller coaster ride and how his life is completely turned around as the story of Lashuda uh the only thing i kept in mind was it's a young film it's a vibrant youthful film that's shot in england and mauritius so it has to be a very modern sound it has to be something that connects with the youth from say 15 to 35 lyrically and uh everything else a song the film is a boss the way i see it so if the film has a certain requirement my job as a music composer is to come up with a song for that situation i do believe in love so i think that's uh, romance has always been will be close to me but uh, i as as an actor i really believe that uh, any genre is a challenge and uh, fun to do so i don't particularly have a favorite genre as such but i really do love uh, you know entertaining people so as long as i can keep doing that i'll be doing it for the rest of my life what goes into it i think number one for me is i love music you know it's for me it's god first with my family and then after that is music so that's what i've been doing for the past 15 years from albums to blah 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 blah, blah. so when i ended up here i actually met girish in a club in bombay when i was on vacation and i said uh, dude i'm trying to do bollywood music i have some really good songs you know let's work on some because I'd seen Romeo Vastavaya, his first film, which I really liked. And he said to me, I don't have anything on the go right now. Let's be in touch when something comes up. I said, cool. So I came back to India and, um, and I hit him up saying, bro, do you have something? And he said, yeah, I'm working on a film. He didn't have a name at the time. And we met and I played, he, he told me a couple situations for songs he was looking for. And I played him two songs, which he picked on, on the spot. And one of them they shot a week later in Mauritius. So that's how it happened for me. Everybody's journey is different. Uh, I think uh, for my debut, it was uh, a little tough because I had no... a particular good form of training and uh, my diet was a little off at that time but uh, after that professional training in my first film my uh, consistency has pretty, been pretty good and what i really believe it believe in is that that you have to be consistent hit the gym regularly and uh, keep eating clean and uh, really you know focus on focus on the kitchen because that's where actually the body's been made The best way to cheer yourself up is to cheer someone else up. And we have definitely mastered the art to that. So take this break, cheer and gear yourself up on your show Yala Dubai.
Welcome back and welcoming you back is a whole bunch of international cricketers that have descended here for the PSL League that recently happened in Dubai. A dinner party that was supported by actors, socialite, politicians and the list go on. Let's take you to be a part of this event. Super League, a professional 2020 cricket league of five clubs run by the Pakistan Cricket Board organized Huata Dubai May and post the match, the key sponsors of the series hosted a gala dinner along with launch of their new product with celebrity cricketers, actors and who's who of Dubai. PSL that happened is, uh, I think, the best thing that can happen to Pakistan cricket. Uh, I mean, we really hope and keeping our fingers crossed that, inshallah, next year, these all matches will be. If all are not, there will be a few matches. If in Pakistan, that will be really great. And uh, this is bringing some really soft image uh, to the Pakistani uh, cricket and uh, to the Pakistan. And uh, let's hope that this thing stays like this and it improves by every passing year. ये कंसीडर किया जा रहा है एस द प्रीमियर प्रोफेशनल लीग ऑफ पाकिस्तान एंड दिस सीरीज विल हैव थ्री फेजेस जिसमें से फेज वन एंड थर्ड दुबई में ही ऑर्गेनाइज हुए हैं मैं आई भी हूँ पिशावर जलमी के एक डिनर पे एंड आई एम वेरी एक्साइटेड और उनके प्लेऑफ से पहले हम ये मीट एंड ग्रीट हैं उनके साथ और आई होप कि वो इंशाल्लाह पीएसएल जीते फाइनल्स में Cricket and glamour go hand in hand and now moving away from that, we have a very interesting event coming your way, the Gulf Food 2016. So let's get your taste buds active for this event. Gulf Food 2016 is a major food and hospitality trade event which kicked off at the Dubai World Trade Center. This event was inaugurated by His Excellency Sheikh Hamdan bin Rashid Al Maktoum, Deputy Ruler of Dubai and UAE Minister of Finance and Industry. It's our first time exhibiting here at Gulf Food. We're super excited. It's been a brilliant experience, a really good platform for us to launch ourselves and sort of display the brands that we're representing here from the UK. We're all about health, we're all about healthy products. Our brands are Planet Organic from the UK and SAF, which are all raw, organic, gluten free, and vegan. Really exciting, exciting products. Gulf Food featured more than 5,000 companies and 117 pavilions and was expected to draw more than 85,000 visitors from more than 170 countries, including international heads of states, ministers, government officials and national trade associations.
this exhibition is an international convention of buyers and sellers uh, where we are coming for the second time and it has been a very pleasant experience for EBM. Uh, we have generated a lot of leads. Uh, the exhibition itself is a big opportunity for Pakistan. This show facilitates multi-million dollar transactions as the global food industry meets, networks, sources new products and trades out at Dubai. The mandate given to me is to somehow bring these products known to the wider world being halal as well as a product of quality and halal by all terms that halal concept and tayyip is understood by halal desiring consumers. The show spans in excess of 1.29 million square feet of exhibition space. We are participating in the Gulf Food since the last uh, seven years and uh, we get an uh, amazing response from this exhibition. Uh, this time around also we met few clients from Morocco, Egypt and a uh, few other countries of European countries and whom we intend to do business. Uh, Tapalti is the largest tea company of Pakistan. Uh, we are the market leaders in Pakistan and we have started to explore the international market since the last uh, eight, nine years. I don't think you guys have had enough, but don't you worry. On the other side of the break, we have something in store for you for all you foodies out there. So stay tuned and we'll be back shortly on Yala Dubai. People who love to eat are the best people, like you and me. And as I promised before the break that we're going to be taking you to a special segment. And right now we take you to a very unique restaurant by the name of The Farm in Al Barari. A place that's considered to be heaven for all you nature lovers out there. You have to experience it to believe it. So let's take a look. Welcome to an oasis of flavor and tranquility. At the farm, they offer a completely new dining experience where great food is eaten leisurely, not rushed. Time with family and friends is cherished, not slotted, into a brief opening in your diary, where outdoor and indoor space is fused together to create an incomparable ambience of peace and calm. Right, so the farm has always been one of my favorite restaurants um, for a very long time right now. Uh, purely because it sort of offers all the different kinds of um, health foods that you sort of like in your plan, such as vegan, vegetarian, gluten-free, and obviously it's nature, it's stunning. So let's take a look at what they have. The farm is also good for you to sort of um, dine in, and even if you don't want to dine in, they do offer very healthy foods that you can take home, um, make it yourself, and obviously bread, fresh bread, smells amazing. After having a little walk around at this stunning restaurant, I'm here now with Chef Eve. How are you? Welcome to our show. Thank you. Thank you very much for having me here and welcome to the farm. 
You know, I'm a big fan of this place already because I've been here a few times. Just tell us um, a little bit about how the menu um, has incorporated with this whole beautiful scenic uh, environment. Well, we do take a lot of time to have the items on the menu that sort of fits in sure. with the environment and with the ethos of the library and the farm. Yeah. So uh, carefully selecting the products, what we get here, sustainability of the product, traceability, and um, knowing where it was uh, from, from the original farm to the table sort of principle that we use here. And um, trying to keep things as pure as possible when we, on the end result. Okay, and what are the cuisines that you offer here as well? Well, we base we are international cuisine, and we okay. have a very strong Thailandese kitchen. Oh, nice! And uh, there's a few items today I would like to showcase to you, and you'll, you'll see okay. exactly what I mean. Okay, and the best seller here would be amongst your customers. Uh, we have um, the sword, uh, sorry, not the sword, the salmon fillet. Oh, nice! Yeah, this the organic salmon from Scotland. Very simple with the uh, pop joy and uh, roasted garlic. Okay, and would you say like right now is the best time to come, obviously because the weather is perfect as well? Yes, we are in a peak uh, yeah. of the season right now. As you can see, everything is in bloom. Yeah. The weather is nice, the, all the windows are open. It's amazing. It's the best time to be here in Perfect. Dubai. Thank you. I can't wait to see your dishes, so let's fog them out. <laughs> okay, so what do we have here? Well, okay, um, nice little spread for you. We have some summer rolls. Okay. okay. Uh, Makino salad, one of the okay. very famous salads. We've got a, a roasted marinated chicken. Oh, they look so good. And a, a small little dessert here, the gluten free chocolate cake. Okay, uh, so you do offer varieties uh, for different diets as well out there? Yes, all, all sort of different diets, um, requirements of the clients that they want. Sure. Um, as you can see here, some gluten free items, some low sugar items. Um, Different, different sort of legumes and pulses that we yeah. can't use here. Um, variety of cheeses, obviously, that is also suitable for kids and adults and maybe pregnant oh. ladies as well. Oh, perfect. Um, okay. Throughout, throughout, lact um, lactose free products, uh, gluten free products, low sugar. Um, we all incorporate all that in our menu. Okay. Vegetarians, vegans, okay. all alike are equal, uh, treated equally. Great, sounds healthy. <laughs> Right, the selections look absolutely stunning. I cannot wait to try it. And this one is? This is the red rice and kiona salad. Okay. It's a very That's typical small. salad that we've had here for since day one of the farm. Okay. It's one of the items that also is, you can see a lot of our different uh, techniques we use into making a, a salad, okay. essentially. And the sure. different products we use. A lot of the products you can also find here in the retail. The direct origin of it, like where it is from, um, the product name, you can, you can now also see it is organic and with fair trade and everything else in okay. favor of it. So okay, cool. Let me try that one. Alright guys, this food is absolutely stunning. Thank you very much. I love everything that you've picked and choose for me. It's absolutely perfect. Aren't you going to have some yourself? Well, I'm, <laughs> I'm, I'm, very, I'm good for now, thank you. Now, I would like to, um, Patrick to give us some drinks right now. Okay. Tell me a couple of those items we'd like to show. Oh yeah, they look refreshing. Yeah. And it's one of your healthy juices as well that you have that's, available here. That's right. All, all okay. Everything freshly squeezed uh, yeah. on order. Freshly blended as well. We've got the lemon and mint. We've got something here called a spicy vitamin. Okay, we've what's in the spicy vitamin? We've got carrot, beetroot, and green apple. And oh, a yeah. touch of ginger towards the end of it. Okay. And we have the fashion breeze on the other end there. Okay. Soda. Okay, yeah. so I'm going to go for this one. <laughs> nice and colorful as well. Pretty. It's a nice little pick me up in the afternoon. A great alternative to a cup oh, of coffee. Oh, so good. Right, the favorite part of everyone's meal. Um, it's time for dessert. So, what do we have here? So, we have a gluten-free chocolate delight with vanilla ice cream. 
Right, Shaka, thank you very much for this spread. Um, and you guys are obviously open for breakfast, lunch and dinner. And do you do all the special nights as well? Yes, of course. We, we have the jazz nights every Mondays and Tuesdays. Right. Um, we have the afternoon teas daily now. Okay. And then you come in and have a nice uh, three-tier stand with us and enjoy the sunset. Okay. Um, plenty of other things that's always happening at the farm. Uh, visit our website, we'll keep you updated on that. Right, thank you very much, Chef. I definitely cannot wait to be back here again. Love the food, definitely recommend everyone to come here and try it out. Thank you. Looking forward to it, thank you. I read this recently and could not resist to share it with you, is that happiness is solid and joy is liquid. Stick in these two forms and have a great weekend ahead. We must take your leave right now, but do come back same time, same show and same social network. Goodbye for now and I'll see you next week.